Yeah, not, not surprising what? at all. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm wondering. Bands from before? Yeah, I don't know what was banned last game. Um, it was Lich Jig. Ah, okay. Yeah, that makes sense too. Also, yeah, that's the other thing is that they their draft phase was was poor either way. Uh, they allowed Eugene's team to get three of what I would consider to be the top tier picks in the meta right now. Oh, like, Bemo's top tier, really? I'd, I I'd would, yeah. I would. B because because Bemo shuts down melees. Like you can't pick melees into Bemo. Yeah, actually, you're right. Now that you, yeah, if I think if you think about it in a draft sense, you're right. You're right. Oh, they first picked the Bemo. Oh wait, no, never mind. It was Flame Princess first pick. That seems weird to me. They got Bemo. It's a Bemo QB. QB. Wow, they didn't pick up the Jake against the Flame Princess. I mean, FP, they should be picking Jake and one other thing here. Yeah. Uh, if I were them, I'd go like Jake. Maybe Jake, Jake LSP. LSP. Yeah. Jake LSP seems really strong here. Rounds out the team very nicely. Yeah, that's that's the game right there. It's PBB Mo versus Jake LSP. Nine Princess. Yeah, <laughs> you can't you can't fight them, and. Uh, PV is not strong enough wave clear. Um, if they pick, if they pick Jake LSP here. Um, uh, I guess maybe Ice King third, Lemon Grab third. Lemon, I'd go Lemon Grab here just because. For the BMO PV comp, you go yeah. Lemon. Um. If they if they take Jake LSP, and then you still are in deficit. Maybe maybe just a magic man just to. I'm I'm considering between oh. lemon and magic man. Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, my problem is they have a Jake, so like. Yeah. But I actually I I like having magic man against. It's weird. Magic man Jake, is a strange matchup. If you can play around him appropriately, then yeah. it's really strong for actually being able to kill Jake, which is often a big problem. Chugging Arizona iced tea, is that what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, that is. I'm That's jealous, a, I'm so jealous. That is that is a green the tea. It's not a, di it's not a diet green tea. Green tea but... with ginseng and honey? honey? Yeah. Dude, diet green tea, man. Give me that aspartame. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> so gross. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I want my cancer, please. Oh, there it is. Alright, that's good. I mean, Jake LSP FP is a really uh, strong team. They lack a, a little bit of wave clear early. Uh, if LSP goes champs, it's not too bad though. I love Techno Tank. I'm, I'm, it's it's a little less power damage, but fucking when you get that fourth point in Techno Tank, your W's on a, like two second cooldown. It's like retarded. Thin. Oh, Finn? Finn into... Into Jake, PB, Jake LST. LST. That's confidence. So oh, wait, out. sorry, no, Jake, Jake, LSP, FP, wow. That's Finn saying, I don't give a fuck to even LSP, I'm gonna kill your flame Let's princess. see what he, is he doing techno tank, or oh, he's going Bella? Yeah, you have to go Bella here. Did you? I don't know, I think techno tank is just better. Actually, I'd probably go... You're against yeah, Jake LSP. If LSP goes Techno Tank, then they're going to be building Robo Suit, and Jake is yeah. going to be building the Crystal Apple. Yeah, you're because right. this whole team is AD damage. So I would go Techno Tank 10 out of 10 yeah. times here. Yeah. I was thinking Billy's for the. Uh, need to burst down the Flame Princess, but that's. I mean, Billy, Billy's is also a good option. Billy's in Techno Tank, but I would I would go Techno Tank. Oh, Forklift team drafted that. Oh my goodness, yeah. that was the other team. Wow. Jeez. Uh, <laughs> he couldn't decide. He went back to Bella. I think that's a mistake. I wouldn't go Bella here. LSP also has just really high base armor. Like, she's 27 yeah. plus 3 per level, I think, or something like that. FP should be Billy's back here. 100%. Billy's yeah, one three at Flame Princess will not die. This whole game. Like should not will not die. 
She has the Jake and an LSP on her team against PB, BMO, FP, or Finn. She, she should not, will not die this whole game. So level one here, Finn, Finn, if you have Finn on your team, you pretty much are guaranteeing that your team is getting the mid altar level one. Yeah. I'm curious what Larva's team is going to do. If they're going to go mid or if they're going to decide to try something else. I'd, I'd just run at them, to be honest. Unless the, if the PB outplays, then I lose the fight. But I... Oh, they're doing their dumb thing again. He's going for their ult. That's so bad. Really? That's so bad. They could guarantee oh, a free mid altar here instead. Okay, are they playing more aggressively? Nope, they got the mid altar too. That's so bad. That should never happen. Especially after you saw it last game. LSP should be ulting. That was the late, really late ult. That ult should have came to help out Jake. I'm slightly behind you. Same. This is a really good experience, or a really good like, opportunity. Yeah. I'm really glad we have this. So we can just we can just talk about yeah. high level mistakes. So the other game was like, oh, they shouldn't be retarded, need a charm. <laughs> this this game. Really nice invade here by Larva's team. Really good. I'm just trying to load the video, please. <laughs> they got two kills and they uh, took the triple camp. So, uh, that's really big for their team. Yep. Um, they should, as much as possible, take They're leaving their bot lane shoved in, though. Jake decided to come up top to try and do some kind of weird play. I don't know what Potato's uh, doing in this situation, but he has no reason to be top lane. He should have just cleared that bot wave to uh, keep the pressure even. I mean, they're, like, really trying to contest... Uh, now they have to go bot, and Forklift's team could even do goo. Like, oh, they could do goo right here. They have a PB. Yeah. They, sh they should goo right now. Oh, right, even right now, you see the LSP. Yeah. Yeah, and here it is. Yeah. This is why, this is why Jake, he came out of base through bot, and he went up all the way this way to come contest nothing. There was nothing to contest here. There's nothing they're going to do. It's not like they're going to push this tower down at level 2. If he had just cleared this minion wave, then they would have been able to come up towards top and contest this goo buff. I want to see what they're building, or the enemy team, what, what backpack flank are I'm sure she's Billy's bag, but, um... She wouldn't be cocky enough to run champs. A bit late in the old again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so now Forklift seems back in the driver's seat. They're gonna hit level 4 first. Clear bot lane. Yeah, I don't know why. Forklift ditched out on all that bot XP just to pick up that health back. I think that's a mistake. Yeah, He's, he could He missed all that bot XP. He could have been level 4 yeah, right now. Yeah, that's really big. When you're ahead, you want to snowball with levels. That's the whole point. Like, he didn't need that health back at all. Start the 3 cap. Just too late. Too now, late. Larva's team's got all the, the minion pressure again, which means they get to get uh, mid altar for free. They're even going to possibly steal the 10 here. Yep. Oh my god, they didn't get it. <laughs> oh my goodness. They lost a lot of turret damage for that, though. Oh, that's not they don't need to three They're gonna it. lose Goo. Goo is, Goo is up. <laughs> PB could have just started. They here. are not rotating correctly at all. Bemo is. Ooh, man. Good thing Jake wasn't in that brush he just walked past. They just really want to catch up on points, but they're, they're really tunnel visioned on points. They're not paying attention to the. Points oh my god, they didn't even get until it. Until the game ends. Larva's team didn't even get the wolf. No way. Uh, that top tier is going down. Yep. 
work to take through camp. Flat this is this is the important like mechanics are really good. They're really important when you're fighting, but macro level decision making is what wins you games in Battle Party. Yeah, we destroy a game of League of Legends pros. It it it, it wouldn't be funny. It'd be a stomp. Wow. He does a lot of damage to, to Jake. Yeah, with the shield pop and the double auto. Oh, the cool thing about draft is that you get the backpack selection. Ugh, that makes me so hard. I get to know whether or not I'm running, or the enemy team's going to be running the ultimate wizard so I can run Sorcerer's Satchel into it or not. Oh god. Fucking draft, man. Now, all, all the things that we've said, they're not that far behind. One one no, good play just, could swing they, this in yeah, Lava's favor. They need one team fight. And it was that early, early game team fight that won them, that got them this level advantage. Oh, he's Sorcerer Satchel 2-4. Yep. Huh, that's really... You saw their team comp. You know what backpacks you're going to be running. Uh, I, like, I like the Sorcerer Satchel on JQ. Really? Yeah, because um, you know that uh, Finn and Bima are probably going to be running Robo Suit. I would assume you ultimate wizard just because you. I mean, if your flame punch doesn't die, you, you're not gonna. You're not gonna lose. This is when I would prioritize CDR really ugly. I don't know because if you're against double Robo Suit, it's really hard for for FP to actually kill people. That could even be triple robo suit. Like, this team could run triple robo suit. Yeah. I, mean, I wouldn't recommend it, because then <laughs> you're all building AD. Which I think is what's happening anyway, but... Yeah. Oh no, uh, yeah. PB's going uh, Glass Cannon Champs. Which is correct. Yeah, that I agree with. Those that or, that or, or Bella, well. Glass Cannon, for... Um, the pen. I, I think I probably would have gone Bella. Force Lift got a 2 0. Um, I like the champs just because you have Finn on your team. So you want to do as much damage as possible, plus as a flame punch the enemy team. You want to blow them up as an LSP. You know that LSP and Jake are going to have a ton of MR. Shields. Oh, that yeah, didn't Shields. <laughs> Had to be that guy. Uh, Z Crazy Zeke's dead. Oh. Oh wow, he didn't get the oh, second auto. Oh, he missed the Q. That's rough. Rip. Oh. You could just run in there and oh. kill that tower. You probably should have done that. There you go. Oh. Well, they're just getting desperate now. They're they're almost two levels behind at this point. Yeah, I wouldn't say you, I actually wouldn't say you know that Jake's gonna be running MR unless he's going. He, he has a choice to make. He either goes two three or two four, and you've got a BMO Finn on your team. I guess that's true. You push away a little harder, feel a little more control, and again, I, I really like bursting down the flame princess. off, do it, you won't. There are ways to lose this game. <laughs> <laughs> Number There's one. There's not many. Start oh, off, they're man. getting out-rotated for the spot tower. Oh my goodness, he's going back for health back? Oh jeez. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense because they were just oh, out-rotating. Oh bot, you lose a team fight. The Larva's team could have just Fork left. turned this whole game around. <gasps> LSP went to the go to the wave, didn't go to the team fight. Even yeah. though the minion wave has stopped at the tower. Uh, it's, I, I've been in that situation, though, where you hard, it's hard to tell, or you're not sure whether or not the minion wave's going to go into the tower, or if it's going to go into the, um, into the next minion wave. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, she chose wrong.
Nice. Oh, we could have fucking reset city off that. Uh, he still got it. Did you upload? No, that's the game. Oh. Yeah, they still got it. Yep. TY PB turret. Yeah. Keep walking away. Oh. Larva team just got outplayed on a macro level. That's the series right there, two out of three. Yep. Did you upload? Lots of lessons to be learned from this one. Yep.